Corvids and parrots are known for having the highest levels of avian intelligence. Perhaps you've heard a blue jay mimicking the call of a hawk to startle other birds and get them to abandon their food source. And if you've ever lived or worked with a parrot, it's clear that these highly inquisitive and sensitive birds are quite smart. Like corvids, they're capable of solving problems. They can mimic speech and other sounds and learn to associate them with specific events and people. So what gives these birds above average intelligence? First, let's get clear about which birds we're talking about. Corvids are birds in the family Corvidae and includes jays, crows, and ravens, among others. Parrots, or cytocines, belong to the order Cytoceformes and are found in the Old and New World, Australia and New Zealand. Bird intelligence has long since been dismissed due to their small brain size. The weight of an American crow's brain is equivalent to that of three nickels, or about 19 grams, and a blue and gold macaw has a brain the size of a shelled walnut. Researchers say that corvids have intelligence that is comparable to a seven-year-old child, and for parrots, a three- to six-year-old child. Well, it turns out that it's not the size of the brain that counts, but what's in it, and how it's organized, that gives them intelligence. And the answer is neurons. There are a few reasons for increased avian intelligence, but this is the most prominent one. Neurons are nerve cells that send messages all over the body, allowing for breathing, vocalizing, eating, movement, walking or flying, and thinking. Their brains are densely packed with neurons, much more so than mammals. A crow has about 1.5 billion neurons, about the same as some monkey species. More neurons means more computing power, and because they are really close together, it allows for more efficient communication between cells. The net result is intelligence close to that of great apes. Furthermore, both corvids and parrots have longer developmental periods. They spend more time in the nest. This allows more time for the brain to develop and create more neurons. Both groups of birds are highly social, curious, need a lot of mental stimulation, and are capable of play. These are all signs of intelligence. New Caledonian crows have been known to make tools to use when foraging. Black palm cockatoo males use sticks to drum on a prospective nesting hollow, hoping it'll be just the right resonance to entice a female to the nest. One researcher said he saw two crows use teamwork at a water fountain. One pushed the button while the other drank the water. Both groups of birds are able to solve puzzles in order to get food, showing reasoning and analytical abilities. They both also have the ability to remember people's faces and whether the interaction with that person was a positive or negative experience. The list could go on and on. Have you ever witnessed the intelligence of corvids or parrots or other birds? If so, feel free to share your experience in the comments down below. Thank you for watching. That's all for this time. I'll see you again soon.